those system discs that we just received, they're the clear out system discs. I don't know if you, you just got the MAM for cruise. The maintenance. They are all on here. This just explains what it is. So we have to So, like here it says, like you just said, you don't know if this is semi annual or. I'm First Lieutenant Gabriel Smith, call sign Shocker. I'm the Company Operations Officer for Air Defense Company A at Marine Air Control Squadron 4. I'm a 7210 Air Defense Control Officer. Ryukyu Vice originated as an air defense focused exercise to improve the combat readiness of Marine Air Control Squadron 4. This is the third iteration of the exercise and with the support from VMFA 312, 131 and VMFA 242, we've been able to tailor the focus of the exercise towards the defense of Okinawa and in the future uh, we hope to integrate desired learning objectives from all participants to increase combat proficiency for all Japan based air defense units. We're conducting integrated air and missile defense training through the execution of large-scale defensive counter-air and offensive counter-air operations. Max 4's mission is to employ a tactical air operations center from aboard Marine Corps Air Station Futema in order to conduct tactical command and control of aircraft in support of large-scale defensive counter-air and offensive counter-air missions. Uh, our goal from this exercise is just to gain proficiency at planning and executing integrated air and missile defense, specifically fighter integration missions between FA-18s, EA-18s, and F-35 Bravos. Training between the TOC and Hornets and F-35s and Growlers within the Department of the Navy is essential for building tactics, techniques, and procedures, and fil familiarity between the squadrons, execution of O-plan and con-plan scenarios. Joint training with our Air Force counterparts as well in the command and control world is equally important for also building those local unit uh, tactics, techniques, and procedures, and familiarity between those units. MAX-4 is unique because we're the only operationally oriented tactical air operations center in the Marine Corps. Our air defense capability from aboard Radar Hill on Futema can be enabled with very short notice in order to conduct real world operations in our AOR. Reacuvice 23.1 is incorporating support from FA-18s from VMFA-312, F-35 Bravos from VMFA-242, and EA-18 Growlers from VAQ-131, as well as controllers on the Air Force side from the 623rd Air Control Squadron. MAX-4 stays mission, mission ready by conducting air defense operations in support of exercises all over Indo-PACOM, from Korea to Guam, mainland Japan, Tinian to Okinawa. The future of MAX-4 will see the expansion of Air Defense Company Bravo, so we will have two operationally oriented air defense companies, and we will also gain more TPS-80 Gators. You'll also just see the continuing presence of our uniquely expeditionary, operationally focused tactical command and control capability.